Well, hello, beautiful people. Hello, hello, hello. Good day, good day, good day. You all, I just wanted to come on um, just to remind you women about the conference this Saturday, November 16th, 2019 at 3 30 p.m. at the Detroit Public Library, the Redford Branch on Grand River Avenue. I am so excited and I look forward to seeing your beautiful faces, okay? You all, we have an awesome panel of women that will be speaking at this event. We have Yolanda Douglas, who is a very good girlfriend of mine. And it's so interesting how we met. I remember we, we were working for uh, an insurance company years ago. And uh, I remember <laughs> I went up to her and I'm like, hey, how you doing? And I remember she say, uh, her saying, she said, is that all you know how to do is smile? You know, and it takes her to tell the story anyway. But. That, that me approaching her with my smile, <laughs> it caused a friendship that we have had for a number of years. We lost contact with one another, but we um, came back together a couple of years ago and it has just been dynamite ever since. Okay. She is a woman who is a diligent servant of the almighty God. She is a humble servant of God. She is a powerhouse, okay? She is a prayer warrior, okay? She is a prophetic intercessor, okay? And she, because of the adversities that she's experienced in her life, it has caused maturity and growth, okay? And what I see is the resilience I see the endurance. I see the passion. I see the uh, the relentlessness that she has, you know, and that drive and that push to accomplish that which God has purposed and created for her to accomplish in his kingdom for him. And it is so amazing to be able to see her being used by God and it will truly be a blessing to those of you who will be in attendance this Saturday. Then we have uh, Tabitha Pittman. And when I tell you, as they say, baby, <laughs> that is another powerhouse, okay? Another woman who has experienced different tests and trials, who has become victorious and triumphant because of the almighty God in whom she serves, in whom she has surrendered her life to. And when I tell you, it's just it's, it's so interesting because when she and I met, we, we met just a few weeks ago and it's like we have known each other for a very long time. But when you have that spiritual connection, okay, when you have that spiritual connection, it's like, I mean, of course it's that it's like a, a kindred, you know, type situation. And, um, and it's like, you know, I know her for she is me. And when we were talking to one another, it was just so, it was dynamic. You know, the anointing was in the midst of our conversation. And it's like, okay, Lord, what do you want us to do? So here we are, you know, November 16th, 2019, having the Woman Arise Conference. And women, listen, I know I've mentioned before, you know, there's always going to be a woman's empowerment something. There's going to be a conference. There's going to be workshops. There's going to be seminars. But when I tell you that because of the way that certain people live their lives, I believe it allows the Lord to be able to move within them and to be able to help to pull down those strongholds and to help bring deliverance and healing in situations, whether it's in your marriage, whether it's between your children, whether it's at work, whether it's in your career, whether it's just going about doing your daily tasks, whatever the case may be. 
I know that this conference is for you, okay? And it doesn't matter whether you are young or seasoned, okay? Because this is the time. The time is right now where you definitely want to make sure that you are in the presence of the Lord. You want to make sure that you are under the power and the authority of the Almighty God. So this way the chains can be broken so that the fetters, Lord, uh, will be taken away and that you can step into your purpose and your destiny. A lot of women don't know who they are still. And we talk about this all the time. A lot of women don't even understand who they are becoming because of the tests and trials that have come to make them strong. They didn't come to break them to, to cause them to be at a low point forever in their lives, but it is to make you stronger. It's to build your character. It is to build up your personality. It is to, 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 to try you, to find out how you will respond in the midst of adversity. How do you respond? So listen, ladies, come on out. This is a free event on Saturday, okay? Um, We are taking donations, but I want you to come and be blessed. That is what it's all about. Come and be blessed. Come and receive. There's something that you have been inquiring of the Lord for. There's something that you have been asking for. There's something that's within your heart. And, you know, you've been waiting for the answer and you are, whoo, You are going to get the answer on this Saturday, November 16th. You are going to get the things that you have been inquiring of the Lord for, the things that you have been petitioning him for. You are definitely going to receive it. Just come on out. Come on out. Come on out. Come on out. Do not delay. This this could be what you need. That's going to take you over. That's going to take you higher. That's going to take you to a whole nother dimension. And to be honest with you, I know that that is going to occur on this Saturday. I know it. I know it. I know it. I know it. And the reason why I know that is because it's like, You just, you know, (laughs) you know, sometimes it's not all, oh, yes, and and this and that and this. No, sometimes you just know, you just have a knowing, you just have a sensing, you know, you have perception and you just know that it's going to be. And listen, bring your friends, bring your daughter, bring your cousin, bring, uh, shoot, bring your husband's sister, um, bring your grandmother, your aunts, your nieces, your cousins, your mentees. Come on out. Do not delay. Do not allow what you've been waiting for to not come to pass any longer. This is the time for those of you who are watching. This is your time. This is your moment. This is your season. You are going to be blown back. You are going to be amazed and you are definitely going to arise to that woman that you have been created to be. So I look forward to seeing you all this Saturday, November 16th, 2019 at 3 30 PM at the Detroit public library, the Detroit public library, the Redford branch on grand river Avenue. It's across from the new Meyer that used to be Redford high school. Anyway, come on out, receive your healing, get delivered, get set free. Let those chains fall off, you know, and, and arise to become that queen arise to become that princess arise to become that duchess arise to become that countenance, uh, arise, just arise, arise. Come on out. You guys come on out. You will not be disappointed. Trust and believe come and taste and see that the Lord is good because he is truly good. He is a good, good father. So come on out. I'll see you all Saturday. Bye-bye.